Welcome back to some more Mario. We are now continuing off on Mario versus Bowser versus Mighty Number no. Nine, I believe this is called. And we were at the uh, whatever you want to call that facility. And we're gonna go ahead and take care of this one. I'm really loving the sprite work, like I've mentioned before. Uh, one thing I've, mm, yeah, I should have uh, put my <laughs> phone down earlier. What I was trying to mention was I'm using another headset, one of these Bluetooth wireless headsets to, uh, you know what, screw that. We're going to go back with the 10 lines. I don't have time for any kind of shenanigans or whatever, but uh, I still get shot in the face. Uh, that's how life is sometimes, kids. Um, but you got to get back up and keep on keeping on, you know? But I like the sprite work. These look like Sonic enemies? I don't know. But uh, Sonic and Mega Man enemies. I dig it, I dig it, though. But I'm using another headset. I tried this on another video on the uh, Mario Dash, uh, maybe the third video of it. Yeah, I, I tried it out there and listened to it a little bit. It sounded okay. I'm not sure about how the video is going to hold up with uh, lagging and whatnot. Again, uh, I haven't touched video games in... Wow, that killed me? I haven't touched video games in a, a uh, little bit now, so I apologize for the uh, sucktacular uh, gameplay that you see here. None of this is going to get me uh, MLG. Do you see that yellow and black line? Enemies cannot go through it. Cool. But Mario can, right? Okay. So he's dropping bombs. Woo! Okay. Ah, so a whole bunch of them. We're going to save. And I still got killed, but I saved, so... How I managed to avoid all that is beyond me. I just know one thing. <laughs> we are saving, and we're going to keep on trucking. Okay, nice little door there. But I don't remember being this far in the hack and the... Uh, Wow. I don't remember being this far in the hack, so some of this is a little... Uh, some of this is blind, obviously this level, but uh, I need to get back on that. One thing that's uh, somewhat current to kind of date this video, because you know I'm good for dating stuff. Uh, wait, how does this work? Oh, you've got to hold down and then you press up for it to go up. That's pretty neat. So, uh, Smash Bros, yeah, it got delayed till October for the 3DS. No harm, no foul, I still may get it on 3DS. I'm really wanting it on the Wii U, though. But uh, they had an Invitational that was streamed on Twitch. And that was pretty cool. I just don't understand why you don't have a Twitch TV app on the Wii U if you're going to stream Smash phone call. And, uh, yeah, anyway, what was I saying? I don't understand why they could stream that for people who may want to watch it, you know, the internet community, but don't have a way to watch that with your Wii U. That would have been... It's just really annoying. I hope that doesn't, uh, I hope that doesn't, uh, interfere. Actually... I'm tempted to pause out of this and and uh, respond to whoever that is, but it's it's one of those things where when I'm busy doing something, people call. When I was relaxing, like I was a little while ago, nobody calls. So it's 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 uh, very annoying to say the least. So wow, this this looks like a a uh, whoa! Did he just shoot out like three fireballs? We're gonna we're gonna run that back. I wish I had a power up. Damn! Screen shakes. It'd be nice if the controller vibrated along with the screen. That would look pretty cool. 
Okay, so he also stuns you when he does that. So with that lesson learned, we're going to go ahead and save. Hopefully he's just three hits. Something tells me he's not, but we're going to see what, what pans out. And we're going to save after every hit, of course, because uh don't have a lot of time. And uh, wow, that didn't kill me. Awesome. So it's more than three hits, apparently. Damn, I wonder if you can jump on him as he's... Let's, let's, let's run that back and see if you can... If you can jump on him as he's... Just missed him. Oh, come on, Mario. When I'm trying to actually touch him. Yeah, so you can't... You can't do anything there. You're going to have to let him uh, hit you there. Okay, so that does it. I just love that sound. Going back to that Smash Invitational, you had people from all over the world, mostly from California though, SoCal was represented, obviously because that's where the uh, E3 was held this go around. But uh, yeah, I was really in love with Smash Brothers. I loved Mega Man as a character there. He was awesome. His final smash was intense. Next level we got here is M Wave Change One. Let's, let's go ahead and save and go ahead and check this level out. But yeah, the characters were awesome, and it's kind of like, well, they've shown you everyone, haven't they? And they did. The select screen looks like all the characters they've shown you so far were playable. So you've got Sonic, Mega Man, you know right there from Jump Street. You don't have to worry about unlocking them or anything like that. It's probably the characters that you know and love, like Luigi, Ness, Captain Falcon, and who is that? The Battle Network Mega Man up there? But it's probably those guys that, uh, whoa, I didn't even get to read the hint box. Welcome to the M-Wave world. You're the first plumber to arrive in this world. Alright, let's save. But yeah, his final smash where he takes out all the past generations of Mega Man, of Mega Man, including the Battle Network one we just saw. Okay, so you can go through the green things, apparently. And they all shoot their uh, M-Buster, X-Buster at you and uh, shoot away anybody on screen, which is pretty awesome. It was. It just is one of the most satisfying things I've seen in video games. Almost like a, a fatality or a, uh, a, uh, what do you call it, ultra or super combo, and, uh, oh, okay, I can ride these things, awesome, and, uh, Street Fighter, so, with that said, uh, very excited for Smash, you even had Reggie, of all people, actually use profanity, somebody from Nintendo using profanity, that, that was something I did not anticipate at all. He basically threatened the kid. I mean, it wasn't that serious. He just basically said, hey, look, he admitted to all of us that he's not that good at Smash Brothers at all, and that now that it's on 3DS, it's on the go, he can get good, and when he uh, gets time, he's going to come back here and kick this kid's ass who won the uh, Invitational Tournament. Now, it did show that Zero Suit Samus is somewhat overpowered or, you know, uh, needs to be nerfed or something. I don't know. I don't want to be the one to start uh, spewing that. But it's just, I'm never one of those characters that play with uh, types like Samus, but uh, Kirby, who was the opponent, could not get in at all to attack, really. It was just, you know, trying to get some crip. Ugh. How did I get hit there? quick grabs and uh, slams in order to uh, win that match. Okay, I thought the invincibility frames would save me there, but whatever. Let's just keep going. Keep going. Don't care. Ah! Like, I saw the arrow saying that I'm almost near the end, and I'm just trying to get through this, hoping I can get through the end. I hate fucking fuzzies, excuse my French. They 
piss me the hell off. But what can you do about it, you know? Okay, I managed to survive, so... I'm gonna go ahead and save right there. Thank goodness that wasn't death. And we've got 15 points. So I'll call this video experimental, if you will. I'm not really sure how the headset's gonna sound, but hopefully better. And we'll keep working at trying to get these to sync up like they're supposed to. And when we come back next time, Searcher Plateau. So thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Tell your friends. If you are going to some cons, you might be able to see me there. I'm working on getting some cards out to grow this channel. I, re I, I, re I really appreciate everything that you guys have done so far. And, uh, you know, let's keep it up. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time.